first alert health alert that brings encouraging news for Alzheimer's patients. This week, the FDI, FDA excuse me, approving for the first time ever a drug that slows the progress of the disease by as much as 27%. The drug name is Lakembi, and it is the first drug to show it can slow the disease by targeting and removing the harmful plaques on the brain, which are markers for the disease, which is still incurable at this time. Brittany Schmidt joins us now after talking with some doctors and the Alzheimer's Association about this today. So let's start with the doctor you spoke with, their reaction to this approval, what it means for them, what it means for their patients. What it means for patients is more time with their loved ones that have that cognitive ability and maintaining it. It also means that the doctor I talked to who runs the research at UW Health when it comes to Alzheimer's disease, it means that when you give that scary diagnosis, you can also offer this hope. Now there are plenty of therapies that help along the way, but this is the first one that truly targets the core of the disease. And so with this FDA approval, it also means more access to people because now with the FDA approval, this drug will likely um, soon to become covered by Medicaid. Okay. So it makes it more accessible, more financially accessible because without insurance for a year supply of this drug, it was $26,000. Wow, okay. Yeah. So hopefully that, that will be the case with insurance, but this yes. does finally put a tool in the doctor's toolbox. Correct. Again, to slow it, it's not mm -hmm. incurable, at, or uh, it's, not, it's curable. not curable at this time, Correct. excuse me. But do, does this drug right here, does it mm -hmm. give them hope that they can get to something that does prevent the disease. Absolutely, I mean, that's the hope in any disease, in any research team looking for a cure for something. And right now, the doctor that I talked to at UW Health, they're actually in the process of a study using the same drug that was FDA approved, Lakembi, as a preventative measure for Alzheimer's disease. So they are right now in the process okay. of studying it as a preventative drug for the disease. So hopefully that will soon also be in their toolbox yeah. We'll wait and see. All right, a first for slowing and hopefully a first for preventing mm -hmm. would be coming. But as we sit here and talk about it, this is big, big news, right? Because as Absolutely. we mentioned, it, it is the first. Mm -hmm. So it's being talked about a lot. It's being reported on. People will have access to it. Mm -hmm. Are there fringe benefits to all this attention on this drug? Yeah, raising awareness about it, fundraising for it, keeping that research going. But also the people that I talked to today, because I talked to the Alzheimer's Association, the Wisconsin chapter, and they talked a little bit about how this really hits home, how important your cognitive memory, your, your health is. They're hoping that with this drug, because it can only be used in early onset right. Alzheimer's patients. So catching it early is key. So they're hoping that anyone who has any concerns about their memory, they talk to their doctor, catch it early because there are ways and now a proven drug to help slow that progress. Right, and you told me we were talking about this earlier, 27% it's not going to be the same for everybody, but it could equal how much time? Uh, the doctor that I talked to said about nine months at that same cognitive level. Okay. So nine months is immeasurable. Nine more months for birthdays, graduations, sure. life events. Truly miraculous, really. And, and changing. All right, Brittany, thanks so much for that update. Still to come.